rain, water from heaven. Sometimes we get too much. Sometimes we don't get enough. We must have water to survive, to grow our food, to enjoy our homes, to run our industry, to improve our quality of life. Rainwater harvesting is collecting rainwater and storing it for future use. How can rainwater be used? Landscaping, greenhouses, fire suppression, gardening, fountains and pools, watering livestock, or kennels, industry such as car wash or cooling towers. A common question is, how much rainwater can I collect? If you are collecting rain off your roof, a one inch rain on a thousand square foot roof will yield 624 gallons of water. Spalding County, Georgia has an annual rainfall of 51 inches. A 1,000 square foot roof will collect 31,824 gallons of rainwater per year. As much as 60% of urban and suburban water consumption is used as landscape irrigation. 50% of that water can be lost to evaporation and runoff. There are five basic components of a rainwater harvesting system. Catchment, conveyance, filtration, storage, distribution. How do you start? Research. What are your requirements? How will the water be used? What products do you need? Which filters, storage, and distribution best meet your requirements? Are there local companies that sell or install these products? ARCSA, the American Rainwater Catchment Systems Association, is an excellent source of information. It has types of systems along with vendors in your area. Visit their website at arcsa.org. The first question is always, what size tank do I need? Of course, the answer is, what will you use the water for? If it is just for landscaping, now remember that a huge percentage of home use is landscaping, then the answer is simple. Get the biggest tank you can. Let's discuss the water requirements for your yard. In the U.S., there are three main divisions of climate classification, dry, temperate, and tropical. The average rainfall for these climates vary from one half inch to one and one half inch rain per week. Weekly watering requirements for these areas range from 0.3 gallons to 0.9 gallons of water. Georgia is a temperate climate state. Our plants require approximately 0.6 gallons water per week per square foot. In a drought or dry spell, how should you use your water? Watering your lawn is an obvious choice, but consider this. A quarter acre of lawn is 10,890 square feet. Using 0.6 gallons of water per square foot requires 6,534 gallons of water. A vegetable garden 20 feet by 10 feet is 200 square feet. Watering this garden would require 120 gallons per week. Now that is doable. Or watering your trees, bushes, or pots in an area 10 feet by 50 feet requires 300 gallons per week. That, too, is quite possible. In times of drought, give your trees and foundation plantings priority. What size tank do you need? The largest you can fit and afford. Newton Crouch sells Norwesco water-only tanks in sizes 305 up to 10,000 gallon for above down use. Berry tanks up to 2,600 gallons are also available. NCI carries a complete line of fittings, valves, and couplings. All Norwesco tanks are manufactured using a seamless rotational molding method. They are made from resins that meet FDA specifications to ensure safe storage of potable water. Norwesco has manufacturing plants located throughout North America. There is a Norwesco plant located right here in Griffin, Georgia. 
Our tank specialists can advise you on the availability and sizes of the different tanks. For your convenience, NCI has compiled a base kit of lid, strainer, and fittings. All you have to do is pick out your tank size. Installation of a Newton Crouch rainwater kit is simple. At least one downspout should be routed into your storage tank. Under the tank should be free of sticks, rocks, and other rough objects. Your tank must be level and fully supported. It should be packed earth, brick, concrete, or fine gravel. Never place it where it could tip over or on a wooden deck. A full tank is very heavy. Water weighs 8.34 pounds per gallon. After you have placed your tank, simply drop in the basket's drainer. Screw on the tank lid and place the gutter through the lid opening. Screw in the overflow fitting, add a length of garden hose, and point it away from your foundation or tank. Screw in your spigot assembly. Make sure the handle is in the closed position. You are ready for the rain. Good for your plants. Good for your wallet. Good for the environment. Proudly made in America. Newton Crouch, a family-owned business since 1940.